master, and in the night they gave themselves to prayer. I'll do all of those things. I'll give you everything else, Charlie, but not my hair. For God's sake, let me keep my hair. Yeah, Charlie. Can I just take a little off the sides to trim my sideburns? You got my soul. Fucking A, Charlie. Fine. But not my Christ-like locks. Look at you, my spoiled children. Proud and ego-driven. You worship hair, not your father. It's all you see of your reflection. Primping, combing, stroking. Squeaky, my child, you handle your brush as if it is your knife. A hundred strokes and you are not satisfied. Death is groovy. Your hair grows another inch. You will stand before me in true humility, shorn of every lock. What have I gotten into? Is it too late to quit? I bet I have to lose my hair, man. Look what I found. Fuck, Charlie. Charlie, dude, it's just a little something to keep my head straight. Your private little stash. God, how selfish. Fuck, ladies. Don't make a federal offense of a little Mary Warner or a couple of roaches. Come down on her, Charlie. She broke the rule. The only rule we've got. No private stashes. And we can't have that. Let me cut her up, Charlie. You, Sadie? Katie here needs to practice. Yeah, yeah do it. You broke my heart, Weevil. Oh, Charlie. Let's do a Solomon number and cut her down the middle. I'm gonna let God decide your fate, Sister Weevil. Wow. Well, Charlie, that's pretty heavy stuff. I'm gonna load this heater and have you do a Russian roulette number on your head. If innocent, the gun won't fire on you. God dude will spare you, girl. But if you're guilty, you'll blow your sad ass brains out. Dig? Oh, Charlie, this is a seven shot. It's got seven bullets in it. Motherfucker draw. Uh, oh, wow. Fucking A. Before I'm freaking out, the gun jammed. I'm innocent. What a bitch. Let me see that. Oh. Kind of funky. What? What we're going to do to Gary. Are you laming out? No. Well, then mellow out. Get into it, man. I'm into it up to the hill. Right, Mary? Well, let's get it on. Excited, Mary? Well, I am. Open up, Gary. It's the fuzz. <laughs> you guys, come on in. Scare you? Hi, man. Yeah, hi, Gary. Yeah, we was just gonna have ourselves a casual little token, you know, but we ran out of matches and we thought of you. Yeah, sure. I can get you happening. Far out. Charlie sent you? Yeah. No, man. Watch your mouth, bitch. This is my gig. It's not Charlie's. Yeah, Mary. Charlie can read about it in the morning with the rest of the lames. They didn't like Charlie's a tricky little guy, isn't he? Good grass. Far out. I feel like they're writing about me already. Isn't it a trip? Yeah, man. Well, don't let them down. We'll give them a good story. Far out. Freaked out games, you guys? You gonna let me in on them? Yeah, we are. No, I'm stoked. I'm glad you guys came over here doping and all. I just threw the I Ching. It freaked me out, man. I was shaking like a leaf. Mellow out, Gary. You wanna suck my cock? What? How the girl's here? Bobby? Look, I'm offering you a taste, man. Gentlemanly like, you know? You s don't fucking spit it back in my face. It's pretty heavy. Yeah? Bobby promised we could watch. Yeah, well, with Charlie it was like selling in my soul, putting his joint in my mouth. Look, man, I'm no fucking Indian giver, bro. I give it to you, no strings attached. Hey, 
What kind of number are you trying to lay on me? You don't accept my love when it's offered to you, Brother Gary. Put away the gun, Bobby. I'll take your cock instead. We've got knives, too. What are you gonna do? Yeah, well, seeing how you won't be reading any papers tomorrow, man, we'll give it to you straight. Ah! Sadie can't ah. stop at one. Look at her get into it. Who's counting? Ah! 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 It is the infinite nature of Christ which has led to such diversities of genius in preaching. And the fifth angel blew his trumpet, and I saw a star fallen from heaven to earth, and he was given the key of the shaft of the bottomless pit. He opened the shaft of the bottomless pit, and from the shaft rose smoke like the smoke of a great furnace, and the sun and the air were darkened with the smoke from the shaft. Then from the smoke came locusts on the earth, and they were given power like the power of scorpions of the earth. They were told not to harm the grass of the earth or any green growth or any tree, but only those of mankind who have not the seal of God upon their foreheads. They were allowed to torture them for five months, but not to kill them. And their torture was like the torture of a scorpion when it stings a man. And in those days men will seek death and will not find it. They will long to die, and death will fly from them. In appearance the locusts were like horses arrayed for battle. On their heads were what looked like crowns of gold. Their faces were like human faces, their hair like women's hair and their teeth like lion's teeth. They had scales like iron breastplates, and the noise of their wings was like the noise of many chariots with horses rushing into battle. They have tails like scorpions and stings, and their power of hurting men for five months live in their tails. They have as king over them the angel of the bottomless pit. His name in Hebrew is Abaddon, and in Greek he is called Apollon. The first woe has passed. Behold, two woes are still to come. Then the sixth angel blew his trumpet, and I heard a voice from the four horns of the golden altar before God, saying to the sixth angel who had the trumpet, Release the four angels who are bound at the great river Euphrates. So the four angels were released. <laughs> Thank you.
the house is built quite upon the shore. There are caves of considerable depth, one on each side, I think. So an eye that was bright green and bright purple. Beautiful. Uh, this is Charlie. This is the G chord. G chord. Here, you I try. I don't, I don't need a guitar if I've got a woman. But Charlie, if I don't have a woman, I Charlie. need a guitar. G is for girl. G is for God. G is for girl, and G is for God. But if I got a girl, do I need a gun or a guitar or God again or a giraffe? Fantastic, isn't it? It's like the Garden of Eden. I want to go home. You're there, Katie. Look, it's beautiful. I want to go there and kill my pig parents. We left them behind long chapters ago. Don't look back. They're as dead as John the Baptist's head. We're in the Revelations now, treading the pages like grape skins. Suck in the spine of its marrow. Let the leaves fall where they may. Shut the covers on me mid-chapter. Press me in your arms. Preserve me as a flower shut between. Build me a pyramid to bury me under. Press the sap out of me. Let it run into the gorge, into the river under the earth. Back to its source, the bottomless pit, which is you, is your heart, is love, is you, is me. Look, my epitaph. If I do another line, I'll probably scarf these poor fingers down to the stubs. Then where would I hold my knife? In a better place, maybe, Sadie? You're always losing it. <laughs> In my snatch, maybe. Huh? You're always borrowing it. Well, that's one safe place you won't find it. I'll get my joint rolled real hard and fat. A real bomber. The kind you like to blow, Sadie. And I'll stash it in your snatch so hard it'll split you in half. You mean my knife will split your thing in half? You'll look like a hippie Satan, only ass backwards. When I get it up, you'll wish I was Satan and that that was only a tail gripped in my hands, choking up on it as high as Matty Lou, and still leaving plenty of meat. You don't score with me that way. Choking up and slapping the ball around the infield. I like a guy who goes long and deep on every pitch. A home run hero. Well, I'm a football man. I know. A center. They probably make you wear the towel, too. Fuck you, you sick bitch. Bring it tonight, too, so the girls can use it to wipe off their bloody fingers with it. 
Last time you were so speedy, you spent three days wiping the fingerprints off. Yeah. Him and... They gave that silly-ass Hinman a good housekeeping award for that one. Too bad the creep wasn't there to collect it. And this time, don't write a book, huh? Charlie said to keep it short. A simple rise and helter-skelter will do. I can't help it. Speed does that to me. It really gives me a head trip. I have to keep dipping the pen into the ink and writing until the walls are covered with blood and poetry. When I see it published the next morning, it makes me so proud I could cry. Charlie and his music, you and your poetry. Am I the only normal one of us? I kill because it's a stone groove. That's something Americans understand. Turn thy tired eyes back upon thyself, and see thou judge not the doings of others. Often something lies hid within. Look, a mirror. See yourself in my image, God's own image, turning the camera on himself so as to live eternally. The Holy Ghost, your sleeping life, your waking life, and your watching life. Once spent is not rewound. Look back to the old swimming hole, see yourself in the bottomless pit. Opie is all grown up now. He has started his own family. See yourself on the cutting room floor, wriggling like a snake. Your life can't slip in the air, erased from the face of the earth, X'd out, a moat in God's eye, a lens that has lost its power to zoom in, see through a screen that shuts out frequencies cast off from God's hawk eyes. Without talons and beaks since the days of Old Testament serials, crudely shot and lit by brimstone, but carefully plotted. All he does now is watch and judge. Your life depicted there, that revelation has you jumping out of your own chair into the good hands of the Almighty, or some briar patch of your own choosing. You choose your own plot, which in the end is marked clearly by your headstone, a mock antenna that receives nothing and halos no crown. So many plots scattered over the earth, falling amidst the tear more often than not, plowed back into the earth too like bad fertilizer, poisoning all it touches with its carcass that outdoes the soul. See yourself in the heavens, reflecting lake, sea, river, narcissist features distorted, turn brown, green, red, by your own waste, diffracted piecemeal with each stabbing wound to the giving surface. Your reflection, Shorty O'Shea, deformed and denatured, a narcissist going to snot and vomit, flesh transfigured into forms that no creator could love and pass on to his own spawn. You tune nature to the shrill, highest, loudest frequency for something to dance to. A dance of death that has swept and polished the dance floors until we see ourselves in their mirrored surfaces, while our souls twist and shout in the sweet ether of abyss, faint echoes as stale as last year's hits. Jimmy has put down his heart so that he can strap you on and jam you until you are played out getting more chords out of you than you thought possible, reaching deep into the most secret hidden wires that you never dared sound, your most inner vibes, and making them go twang, dismissing you in two chord progression, playing you with your head, composing ditties that you can't help humming to yourself idiotically while the rest of us hear heavenly choir, strictly bubblegum, can't get anything good out of this guitar, more stage prop than instrument, breaking off the out of tune, never in tune, can't teach them to tune strings with his teeth, I describe this all to you here, like a mirror that lets you see your death face, making meaning and terrible harmony out of the faceless, incoherent terror. There is nothing left but to burn, and Jimmy's nimble fingers squirt pure fire that soon engulfs the stage itself, giving it back to the universe. Wave your freak flag high and surrender, but it will go up in flames with the drawn stage curtains as the audience struck dumb to stone to cry, Pia! stares into the stage as it collapses in fire around them. That piebald face you see in the oil-slicked pool pulls you under like an undertow. But there is no cleansing baptism that washes clear the sins of your mother and father, your rip-torn blood boiling in race hatred for the both of them. Never taking God's creations at face value, they have it that their crude mixtures and experiments will improve his store. The blood running through your veins is as muddied as the stilled waters where the Potomac and the Mississippi meet. See your reflection in the melting pot. Even on the clearest day, you cannot see the bottom. The fairest one of all can pass for white. 
You have stamped the earth with your own reflection, ravaged with wrinkles and lines of your own creation, the incriminating fingerprint that scares off the spacey races. Your earth's reflection, man's own earth, all papers in order, its reflection on the moon in eclipse. Well, before we start, I know this isn't going to work. All right, if you, what did you say your name is? Charlie, sir. Mr. Director, sir. What's your sign? Scorpio. Of course. Need acid? I can turn on the whole crew. You just give me the part. Frank, tell the freak what we want from him. Here's a gig. You're testing for the role of the devil. Okay? It's a comedy role, Dig. Um, now, Mr. Polanski wants you to freak out for the camera. Here, let's get some action. Charlie Guy. What's he doing? I'm supposed to be directing you. What's going on? Fuck, I'm losing my mind. Crazy head trip. Far out crazy game. Roman, baby, you okay? What's wrong with your head? God damn it. What did you do to him? What did you do with his head? Mm -hmm. It's clean, gone. <laughs> <laughs> Brainwashed. You've stone hypnotized him. Lift up thy eyes to God on high. Whoa. What have you done? What have you done with my eyes? Where are my eyes? Your eyes, your soul. Check it out, dude. Crazy far out trip on digging. Who's that? Where am I? That's your soul, man. Wow. It's come alive in living color. Proving on this. Keep on space trucking. And keep on, keep on, keep on. I can't see. I can't see. Get inside your head, brother Tex. It's the scene, man. It's where it's at. Bullshitty game you're running on me, Charlie, dude. You got my eyes? Shine them. What next? My cock? Bet that will really get your rocks off me, Mr. Manson. Just leave me a thumb so I can trip on out of here. We're just turning them on to the nitty gritty. Low down. Low down. Mother loving reality trip, boss. Leader. Keep on doing me that way. Don't bring me down, acid god. I can't take the bring down. Dude, I'll die mungy. Flash on it. I can see myself. Something heavy's going down. I'm with that Tate chick, and we're making love. God, she's beautiful. I gave you back your head when I snatched your eyes. Now trip on it. Just 
drop the universe look like a purple micro dot billion trillion mites lab pure the creator's own I'm about I think Gowsley had a hand in it. I'm about to come and share it. Oh. Have your jolly stud. But the seed is my own. You've got to know someone. Someone big to get turned on to those magic beans. Not any old Jack gets to shoot that ratchet's white stuff up his beanstalk. Blow my mind. I'm so high, my pupils are black holes sucking off entire solar systems. Oh, swallowing them whole like cherry lifesavers. Oh, I'm shooting the Milky Way. Tastes like heaven in the roof of my mouth. Some out of sight snow job horning in on God's private stash. She's pregnant. Sharon's pregnant. It's a boy. so expanded. It slipped the whole continent heavenward on its powerful shoulders. So, so look at me. I'm stronger than you, Charlie Atlas. I kick back and watch the false ceiling rise upward. The roof blow. The sky crumble. I watch as the raised arch breaks into a million pieces and finds its own cosmic geometry. As the portholes grown wide, the steeple wilts grow soft. Mary has gone day glow. She flashes me the peace sign. I wear her like sunglasses. Jesus has stepped down off the cross and is now playing with his stigmata like some tuned-in hippie Thomas, getting off on his own image, reflecting his eyes rolled back into his head. An image formed by Michelangelo's hand and restored to life, but not transformed, transfigured except for the hard as marble cock, raised erect, supernaturally large. When he comes, I spit it out in disgust. Your cathedrals offer me no shelter. I'm hip to your stained glass scenes laid out for me. Unshuffled dealt from the bottom of the deck. Games, man. I see through them like head, shot, kaleidoscopes. I need stronger stuff. Something that will get me goofed up. Like the dude on the cross. Crazy far out head drug. The stuff Charlie keeps for himself. Just a little something to get my head.